Hey, it's MarkService12 here, and recently I've been making something in Flash. Um, the reason I've been making this is just for, like, fun or whatever. To, I guess, challenge myself. Um, to, you know, recreate something in Flash which is uh, kind of complex. What I'm making is PictoChat, which is something. Well, it is an application which came with the Nintendo DS and the Nintendo DSi. <coughs> this version is the DSi version, although the difference, as far as I know, is just the uh, they've added one extra tool in. Um, first of all, I started off with a class known as in Flash, known as the uh, graphics class. So if I just open that up right now, wait, can you see? Yeah, you can. So, um, what a graphics class is, um, you create a movie clip, or a sprite, or a shape, and then you fill it with vector graphics. You can draw rectangles, circles, probably other shapes, I don't know. And you can do, you know, basic, um, pen drawing tools or whatever, where you, like, free draw, and it turns it into a shape. So, um... That seemed pretty straightforward, until I realized there's no erase. There's no erase tool. So, um, you may be thinking, oh, well, uh, surely there has to be <coughs> something you use instead. Or can't you just, I don't know, fake it, like, color over everything white? Well, I could cheat and just have the user paint white over everything. But then you'd have a transparent color then black, and then white. I don't know, it's kind of a minor detail. But I thought, no, I'm going to see if I can actually uh, find a way to get this working. Oh boy, what a workaround. Okay, so first, I'm going to do the reverse of what I originally planned for this video. I'm going to change some numbers back. Uh, four and four. And four and four. And down here should be something. Or is it? I just said I haven't organized any of this code yet. Just none of it whatsoever. It's all junk. Oh man, where is it? <coughs> um I'm getting so lost on my own code. Uh okay, it's F F F F was it? I'm so bad at this. FF zero, 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 FF. Oh, there we go. Oh, it is. I oh, got damn it. As I've changed this to FF. Oh, yeah, that makes sense. Okay, uh, if I go back to this. Okay, there we go. Uh, ignore this part down here. <laughs> so right now you can't see the cursor because I'm recording differently. But right. So, you draw on the screen and da 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 da. It, everything's like normal or whatever. But I found out a way to, like I said, um, walk around the paint thing. So right now it is actually drawing white ink. As you see, I'm racing the lines in the background. But look what happens when I let go. Dun dun dun! This is a really complex. Well, not really complex, but it's. Uh, outside of the box thinking. <coughs> what I've done is, I've got... Actually, it'd be easier if I uh, demonstrate by undoing what I've just done. Derp. Oh, actually, you can't see. Whoops. Uh, derp, derp. Is that everything? I think that's everything. Is there any more? Okay, let's just double-check. So... Pay attention to oh, hang on a sec. Um, pay attention to the um, to this box and the box above it. Okay, uh, let's see. Um, uh, jump. There we go. So I'm going to draw the pen tool. Okay. So first of all, it starts off in this canvas at the top, and then it places it into the box underneath. And when you want to draw again, it does the same. Derp, 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 derp. Derp, 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 derp. As for the eraser, it does something similar. Uh, normally, 
well, just a moment ago, as you saw, I had uh, white ink. I've changed it to pink, so you can actually see what's going on here. So, you draw your eraser up here, which is supposed to be white, and then it overlays it with the original drawing. And no, it is not a mask, because, well, uh, masks work in the opposite way, I believe. C um, the more that's colored in, the more of the object you can see. Uh, so, what it's doing is, it's... um converting it from a shape into a bitmap data. So the box you see that uh, the, the box where all the squiggles are being sent to uh, the, like the, the second box you know what I'm drawing on right now. Not 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 the box at the top, but the, the box Oh yeah, I can I can draw an arrow, can I? Like the box down here. <laughs> this is the the box where all the graphics data is sent to converted into a bitmap form. So, uh, if I go back to this, uh, no, where is it? Mm. Nope. Uh, ah. So, oh, yeah, hang on. So, this is a graphic. This, that's how I'm able to do the drawing. And then, as soon as I let go, it, it sends this into here, converting it into a bitmap format, and then deletes whatever is in here. And um, that's kind of cool, I guess. And as for the eraser, it does the same thing, but there's a blend mode known as Erase, which is kind of funny, actually, because it's only part of the bitmap class. So it compares a vector graphic to a bitmap image and then erases the bitmap image, you know, according to the graphic. Uh, sorry, uh, vector, or whatever. <coughs> Something like that. So uh, when I layer all that together, you don't even notice... And uh, yeah, there we go. Uh, because it's like all together at the same time, so you don't notice the thing jumping from one movie clip to the other or whatever. I think I've explained way too much. I'm so sorry. Well, what the hell's going on with the mouse and the the recording screen? Uh, that's really weird. Okay, let's try it again. Because I want to show you guys something else. Uh huh. Okay. Happy face. Yeah, that's working. So, um, one the very first thing I did in this picture chat before I got any other code working was this. Oh yeah, it's so cool. Oh, the pen is just so amazing. I love this pen. I, I just. Oh, OBS is messing up again. What? It's Flash messing with all the windows. Urgh. Okay, so, uh, yeah, it's so awesome, and you can draw in rainbow ink! Except for some reason, the, um, it lags in the actual Flash player, outside of Flash, but it's fine when embedded in a browser. I don't understand. Whoa, 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 so cool. Oh, yeah, and you can do this, and this actually works too. Ah. Uh, oh, yeah. Oh, so so awesome. What I like doing is um, I've coded this button, this Triforce button, to do this. But I haven't got any of the uh, masking options, you know, sorted yet. So you can just like squiggle parts of the background out. I'd like to have a live uh, mask thing to go with this erase tool, but I can't work out to get it working, or find figure out how to get it working or whatever. It's kind of annoying. Oh, it's so cool. Uh, what else have I got working? So, obviously, the keyboard. If you click it, it actually says where your mouse position is, and that's about it. I can't work out to get these individual buttons to act as individuals. Um, did I do anything else? Um, I don't think so. I haven't, like, gotten the uh, sending picture thing to the top screen yet, or whatever. But yeah, like, I think this is coming along GR8, you know, uh, and stuff. Oh my gosh, whoa, how long have I been recording for? Nine minutes, oh god. I don't feel like editing this. So, for any of you who actually feel like watching this, like, thank you for... Uh, <laughs> this is why... This is why I'm afraid to record long videos, or videos at all, 
because my voice gets really tired really quickly. Yeah, I can sit in my own room for hours on end talking to myself and never get tired. But as soon as I get on camera, it's like... I have no idea. Maybe it's because I like drink fluids and as soon as they go down my throat, they dry my throat up or something in preparation for it. That sounds like a... Oh, I don't even know. <laughs> I have no idea. Right. So, um, next goal is um, working out how to send images to a database. You know, my SQL database. I can't remember if I can or not. Might not be that tricky, I don't know. And then working out how to read that data, you know, using the copy tool to copy it from um, a picture that's already been sent out and then copy it back into the drawing board. Which, in theory, shouldn't be too hard. And then maybe I can start working out how to do the keyboard. That's going to be fun. Oh my god. Okay. I think I'm done. I went on for an extra two minutes. Alright, bye!